economy is in a fragile state. It is growing. It is a recovery, but not as uh, um, you know, strong as what folks would be. What about public worker pay, though, if some of these reopening clauses or evergreen type clauses trigger? You know, we haven't heard that from the Attorney General, General's Office right now on the impact of those uh, favorite nation provisions right now. We're just happy that the teachers finally settled their contract, a six year contract. And, you know, they're going to do the same as the rest of the public workers for the first two years, so that's, that's good. What kind of hit are we taking on that under uh, HSTA? Do we have a... Uh, we, we, we haven't come out of a number right now. I know that they're taking a 5% uh, pay cut the first two years to everybody else, you know, the 50-50 split of the ETF, so we, don't, we, don't, we haven't touched it on yet. So we don't know the cost of that? Well, it's going to be in the out years, yeah. It's going to be in the third, fourth, and fifth, and sixth year. I think it's on a performance-based uh, contract for the evaluation of each individual teacher. New EOTF numbers though, nine billion unfunded. Is there a way out of this hole even even on the basis of this year? Well, we're going to try and see. In fact, we're having a briefing tomorrow morning at nine o'clock, and we're going to try and look at the big uh, big issues uh, facing us, along with the uh, things we might be looking at this year uh, to address that you know, unfunded uh, mandate.